Hello ladies and children, my name is Helium Lemon 15 welcome back to The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. Tattle just gave us a message at the beginning of this morning, this three-day cycle. She says, the quickest way to the canyon is through the Ace Gate. Because this is the first three-day cycle that we've been on since uh, completing the Great Bay Temple. And now, I think we're going to do a little... No, way. No, never mind. I don't think that's gonna work. So, we might as well listen to Tattle's advice after all and go through the East Gate. Now, there were some things at Ikana Canyon that I could have done before doing the Great Bay Temple, but I didn't. So, we're gonna go to Ikana Canyon. And guess the temple is called Stone Tower, but the area is called um, Ikana Canyon canyon um don't worry it's not the only it's not the only area like that because there there's you know southern swamp slash woodfall there's goron village slash snowhead or mountain village slash goron village slash snowhead there's a uh, great bay coast slash zora cape and uh from there i think that's the stone tower temple or or at least the stone tower or whatever it looks very um, strange. It looks like a big uh, stone cactus. I don't know if anybody's said that before in an LP, but then again, I don't watch a lot of LPs. Or uh, I used to watch quite a bit of LPs, but will you back up? Back up. Thank you. Back up. Okay, back back up more. And I'm invincible to bombs while on a horse. <clears throat> it's a fact of life that we all need to learn. The reverse controls are weird. And that apparently worked. Alright. Um... Yo, buddy. Hee hee hee, what are you doing in a place like this? The mask that contains wandering spirits. How's this? That's a nice mask you're wearing. That is the mask of the leader of the ninjas who once spied on the hilltop castle with the blood-stained history. Ooh. Perhaps you may be able to save the souls that wander beyond here. Yee hee hee. Yee hee hee. So... As you may have guessed, the game is about to start getting slightly darker in tone. This next area is filled with a lot of ghosts and mummies and stuff. And there was a game theory that I, w I was just thinking about. Oh, there are some like weird game theories about um, uh, the Stone Tower Temple that actually get kind of like, I guess like, graphic sexually <clears throat> but they're like they go like really deep and they're like really crazy and it's funny because I was hanging out with my friend today and, and talking about uh, different game theories some of the darker game theories uh, I mean like there's stuff like Five Nights at Freddy's which was like all actually confirmed by Scott Cawthon what? hi I didn't have my shield. This reminds me of Breath of the Wild because of, of all the Yiga fights in that game. And yes, these guys are done in one hit. Regrettable, although you were my rival. She'll take my bow. To cross the valley of Ikana, aim at the river beasts with the arrowhead that freezes belief or disbelief. Rest with you. To die without leaving a corpse, that is the way of the Garo. That's the way with most video game enemies. I mean, as, except in, like, fighter and horror games, but... Are you kidding me? I don't have arrows. Ah, uh, buggity, 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 bug. Where do I get arrows? That's always the question. That's always the question. That's always the struggle. That's always the question. That's always the question. That's always the question. Freaking arrows. I always need them. I never have them.
Alright, so I guess I'll talk to you in a second. Oh yeah, but again with like the, um, to continue with the, like the Dark Enix, uh, disturbing video game theories, like it's, it came up because we were, I was, we started talking about like the disturbing video game music, uh, playlist. Okay, so why, why didn't that work? Why did I blow up the rock, but not that guy? Also, I love these fake Goron enemies, the Nejiron. They're, they're very strange. And contrary to popular belief, they have legs. No, I'll, I'll talk about that later. The Berenstein Bears phenomenon. No. The Nelson Mandela phenomenon. That is, that is one of the stupidest and greatest things. Excuse me? What is this? Why is there... Here are stones, please give me arrows. What happens if we go over here? I believe this is the way we actually want it to go. Yeah, it is. Alright, here's the Akana Graveyard. F forced to go over here because we don't have arrows, but this is the way we actually want it to go. Uh, I'd still like arrows, but doesn't mean we're going to get them anytime soon. Secretly hoping for arrows. Hey, please give me arrows. Oh my gosh, this game. What is going on over here? That looks like a thing. It's probably not a thing, but it looks like a thing. What are these things? It's just like weird moss. Is there a, a owl statue somewhere? Because that would be really nice and to not have to come back to the beginning of this area. No, there's not an owl statue anywhere, of course. There's arrows in one of these bushes. Yes, there is. Thank you. The door's locked, so no one must be home. Alright, here's a big old sleeping skeleton. Uh, the game doesn't really give you any hints about it, but this is what you're supposed to do. Wait, I... that was the wrong song. That was from Ocarina of Time. I was about to play the Prelude of Light. Uh... No, that's the Minuet of Forest. Um... That's the... Wait, that's right. Da-da-da-da-da-da-da. Yeah. Good grief. I haven't even played Ocarina of Time recently, but like the first thing that came to my head was the Prelude of Light. That was strange. Ah! It's alive! Oh. And my audio is bugging out. Maybe I need the spin attack and I need the bunny hood and I need to get knocked back several hundred times come on
That's more like it. He's escaping. I can't even see him. If you cannot even catch me, then... Something. And if you come up here, there's a chest over there, but it's on fire, so we can't get it right now. Alright, let's try that again. Sometime, eventually, this year. There he is. Isn't that a big skeleton diaper you got? You think you're so scary? Boom. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Come on. So close, come on. No. Ladies, no. Darn. Okay, third time's the charm, right? No, no, no. What a great sonata. It's sonata, sonata. It's another fish. <clears throat> It's pretty great that I was referencing horse feathers in my last Endless Ocean video. I was talking about... A stage and you crazy, that's a doctor who cut you up when you see. Uh, is it haddock? Ah, uh, that's a funny, I got a haddock too. Talking about different fish. Okay. And then that's the movie that I decided to watch with my dad that night. Wait! It is my loss! Sheathe your weapon! I commanded the Ikana army of Ikana Kingdom atop the hill, and it's called Skulkita. Since being shamed by loss in a battle within my kingdom, I have waited here for one to come and awaken my soul. This is some scary glowy eyes. Young swordsman who has awakened and deftly defeated me, I shall rely on your power to fulfill my request. I ask you to take my soul, which rests in the fiercely burning flame, and convey my words to my men, who even in death remain loyal to me. Tell them the war has ended. Then I shall be able to drift quietly into sleep. Captain, sir. May I take leave, sir? This game, always trying to make you feel like you're in a dream, or at least you're in a dreamlike state. And then especially in this part of the game when you start communicating with all these undead spirits, it's like, it's like a little bit almost Twin Peaky, Twin Peaksy, Twin Peaky Peaky. <clears throat> Maybe not. But anyway... 
Dingy, 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 dingus, 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 dingus. You're a dingus, you're a dingus. And we get the captain's hat, too. No, I'm kidding. The ghosts of a hundred soldiers swedge, 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 swear allegiance to this symbol of authority. That reminds me of the word coil. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Alright, well that was a thing that happened. And now, we can go to the Akana Graveyard. Oh, right. So tune in next time for more uh, The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. And thank you for watching this episode. It means a lot to me. See you in the next one.